Today, the White House announced it's sending out more COVID vaccine and sending it to some of our neighborhood pharmacies. But the question is when you'll be able to walk in and get a shot. None of your sides, Craig Smith, puts that question to Pima County's chief medical officer. Up to now, most vaccinations have happened at mass vaccination sites where people drive up for their shots. In Pima County, COVID vaccinations are still limited to education workers, first responders, and people at least 75 years old. Now the White House has announced that starting this week, it will add 10.5 million doses to vaccine supplies nationwide and send a share of that to retail pharmacies as soon as February 11th. Based on decisions from the Arizona Health Department, Pima County already expects pharmacies in four local fries and two Safeways, but the local chains have not confirmed when they will open vaccination appointments. And Dr. Francisco Garcia of Pima County says the county is still in the dark on when those vaccines will really arrive. The White House and the federal government are saying all the right things. Um, and, and the real question is, um, what is the reality on the ground? He says he's hopeful, he's optimistic that new national strategies will pay off. But I would be lying to you if I were to say um, that I that all of a sudden we have, you know, 30,000 more vaccines in Pima County because of it. And he says with more vaccine, they can work through any other challenges. We're not going to sit on our hands. If we have vaccine stock, we will put it into people's hands. We will figure out the finances. We will figure out the staffing. Um, at the end of the day, it's all about um, vaccine stock. Craig Smith, KGUN 9, on your side.